going to look at question 23, which was done in KCC 2021 Paper 1 Mathematics. The question says that the masses of 40 adults who attended a health clinic were recorded as follows. And this is the data for the masses of 20 adults which were recorded down. So the question is as follows. Complete the frequency distribution table below for the above information. Use classes of size 5 starting with the class 40 to 44. So we need to know from the data given the lowest mass and also the highest mass. That is actually referred to as range. Now just looking through, we can be able to see that 41 is the lowest mass and then 74 is the highest mass. So from 41 all the way to 74. But we have been taught to start with a class of 40 to 44. And we have been given the class size is 5. So in that case, we need to fill up. So we keep on adding 5. So 40 plus 5, that is 45. Then 45 plus 5, 50. Then 50 plus 5, 55. 55 plus 5, 60. Then 60 plus 5, 65. And 65 plus 5, that is 70. Then also on this part, 44 plus 5, that is 49. 49 plus 5, 54. 54 plus 5, that is 59. Six, 59 plus 5 is 64. And 64 plus 5, that is 69. And finally we get 74. Then from there we need a column for tally marks such that we are going to enter each stroke. So we start with the values from between 40 to 44. So I will try 40 to 44. So if I count, let me see whether I can see anyone. 40 to 44. So I have one. Then the other one is two, three. So there are actually three. Let me see whether there is another one. Four. So there are four. One. This one, two, three, four. Then from forty-five to forty-nine. 45 to 49, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6, 7. So between 45 to 49 is actually 7. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then 50 to 54. 50 to 54. So we can have 50 to 54. 1. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there are eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then 55 to 59, 55 to 59, 
One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then sixty to sixty four. 60 to 64 so we have 60 to 64 1 2 3 4 4 5 6 Seven. So we have seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then sixty five to sixty nine. Sixty five to sixty nine. One. Two, three. So I have three. One, two, three. Then finally seventy to seventy four. Seventy to seventy four. One, two, three. Four, five. So there are five. That is one, two, three, four, five. So frequency we add the tallies. Here we have four. Then we have seven. This is eight, six, seven, three, and five. Then we get a midpoint of x. 44 plus 40 divided by 2 we get 42 the other one we add and divide by 2 we get 47 50 plus 54 divided by 2 we get 52 55 plus 59 divided by 2 we get 57 60 plus 64 divided by 2 we get 62 65 plus 69 divided by 2 we get 67 and 70 plus 74 divided by 2 we get 72 and from there we need to find the column of fx that is we multiply the column for frequency and the column for mid point x so in this case 4 times 42 we get 168 then 7 times 47 we get 329, 8 times 52, we get 416, 6 times 57, we get 342, 7 times 62, we get 434, 3 times 67, we get 201, and finally 5 times 72, we get 316. So in this case, we need to find sum of fx. And in our case, if you use a calculator and you add this value, you should end up getting 2,500 and I mean 250. Summation of f, if you add all of this, you should get 14. Then from there we have the last column which is called cumulative frequency column and in this case we had the frequency one by one cumulatively. So in this case we shall get, we start with 4, 4 plus 7 that is 11, 11 plus 8 
19, 19 plus 6, that is 25, 25 plus 7, that is 32, 32 plus 3, 35, finally 35 plus 5, that is 40, and we have 40 adults in our case. Then from there, we shall answer the next question. Estimate the model class. In our case, we need to know that model class is the most frequent data. So, which is the most frequent mass. And we look at the frequency column. The frequency with the highest value, that is the model class. So, in our case, 8 is the highest. So, our model class is 50 to 54. 50 to 54 kilograms. That is the model class. Then, part the other part, which is part B, estimate the mean mass. Mean is given by sum of fx divided by sum of frequency. And in our case, fx sum of fx is 2250 so we have 2250 we divide by sum of f that is 40 so using a calculator we shall end up getting 56.25 kilograms then from there lastly we look at the median mass we estimate the median mass remember median is given by that is lower class boundary plus n over 2 position minus frequency cumulative frequency preceding the median class all over frequency of the median class we multiply by the class interval so from there the first thing we needed to choose is to get the median position and the median position which is given by n over 2 which is n is 40 therefore we get 28th position so the median mark our position is the 20th so from the frequency distribution table we can actually identify the median position from the cumulative frequency table and in our case here 20 19 does not have 20 inside so 20 belongs in 25 so this part is our median position or the median class so this is the part so from this particular point now we need to get the median and the median is given by lower class boundary so in our case lower class boundary here it is 54.5 54.5 plus n over 2 that is 20 minus cumulative frequency preceding the median class which is 19 minus 19 over frequency of the median class which is 6 so that is over 6 then you multiply by the class width or class size which is 5 so from here we have 54.5 plus 1 over 6 multiplied by 5. So finally we shall end up getting 54.5 uh, 5 divided by 6 we get that is plus 0.83 3, 3 and so on so finally we shall get 
55.3 or 55 and a third kilograms and that is the answer.